Steel manufacturing from iron ore to finished product, steel is one of the most important metals in the world and is widely used in many industries. Steel manufacturing has been prevalent since the Industrial Revolution, when steel started becoming a material in demand for making various types of machinery, weapons, and construction. Steel in construction is the most important use of steel. How is steel manufactured? The common raw material for iron and steel industry is iron ore. The primary raw material used to manufacture steel is iron. All steel alloys are primarily iron and 0 to 2% carbon by weight. Iron ore, coke and calcite, lime are added to a blast furnace to produce molten iron. This iron is used as the raw material for steel manufacturing process. The primary raw material of steel is iron processed from iron ores. The production of steel follows the basic oxygen steel making method or electric arc furnace method. Both these methods produce high quality liquid steel which is further processed to various shapes. As you all might already know, the basic process followed for making steel is by mixing carbon and iron at very high temperatures above 2,600 degrees Fahrenheit. This method is of two types. I. Primary steel making. Primary steel making involves making steel from pig iron. Pig iron is smelted iron from iron ore, which contains more carbon. This smelted iron undergoes the basic oxygen steel making or BOSS method or electric arc furnace or EAF method. BOSS method, recycled scrap steel is added to the molten iron. Oxygen is blown into this mixture at a really high temperature to reduce the overall carbon content and create equal oxidization throughout the molten metal. The AF method, recycled steel scrap is put through high power electric arcs with temperatures as high as 1650 degrees Celsius. The high current electric arcs from electrodes melt large quantities of steel scraps into liquid. The furnace then blasts in oxygen, lime and floor spar to purify the liquid and convert it to high quality steel. Secondary steel making. Secondary steel making primarily involves refining the steel or adding various other elements to steel to make the steel feature rage. Elements are added at specific temperatures following different processes to create the desired composite. Processes like string, ladle furnace, ladle injections, degassing, and cash op. Composition adjustment by sealed argon bubbling with oxygen blowing are used in secondary steel main. 
Refining steel is done by injecting argon, nitrogen, or oxygen through the base of the blast furnace. The quantities of iron ore, lime, and scrap steel that goes into steel making are precisely calculated to ensure correct temperatures are applied to the process of making steel from iron ore. This also ensures the perfect composition of the steel. Final step of steel production. The liquid steel from the furnace is then put into a mold to create solid steel. This could be steel billets, rods, bars, etc. Steel undergoes these processes to be shaped into its final form. Shaping cold rolling slash hot rolling methods, machining, welding, coating galvanizing with zinc, or cold coating and electro coat, heat treatment, surface treatment to remove impurities. Steel is most widely used in the form of steel coil made from steel slabs. Steel coils are made by hot rolling, cold rolling, or by using the electrolytic tin plate, ETP, method. 